بالنسبه لك في اي توبيك مش واضح ولا دكتور انا لسه ما بداتش مذاكره قوي يس فما اقدرش اقول حاجه يعني سوليد يعني <تصفيق> ما اقدرش اقول حاجات ابقى مسؤول عنها بعد كده اوكي اه بالظبط كده هو يعني عشان ما اضيعش بس وقت زمايلي وكده يعني يس 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 يو اف سنسي بصوا يا جماعه هو فعلا زي زين الدين ما قال انه maybe maybe the majority of you didn't start yet the study of this subject and you leave it to the end i know Uh, that's why let me please if you want if you want we can rapidly make a global revision on all you see uh, let me open my book as the book in your hands if you have it and rapidly I can make a revision on a machine to kill okay so what is the story of hospital management as a subject In this subject, simply we give you titles and some key sentences about the management of a hospital or the management of a health care facility. Okay, that's why you have to know some some few differences, and to make it clear, I'll emphasize on them. علشان هي دي اللي you will find this in your questions uh, on the day of the exam. For example, what is the difference between management and administration in general, in big terms? What's management and what's administration? Okay. Simply, simply, yes, simply uh, management. means that you are you are responsible for application and follow up of all procedures that have been set and decided by the administration so which is higher than which administration is higher than management بالبلدي management يعني إدارة أنا هدير المستشفى مانجمنت هدير اللي حاصل واللي الأدمنستريشن قالت لي عليه سو أدمنستريشن ركزوا في اللي بقوله ده أدمنستريشن إز مانت باي سيتنج أوبجيكتيفز يبقى مين اللي بيحط الأوبجيكتيفز أدمنستريشن أدمنستريشن ديسايد ذا أوبجيكتيفز سيت ذا أوبجيكتيفز Set the whole procedure, and then you, if you are the manager, management means application and ten fees. Okay, دي حاجة مهمة لازم إحنا نعرف. Okay, أنا بعد جال حاجات اللي تهمنا أولا. Okay, objective. You have you have to know the difference between goal and objective. Goal is the ultimate, the ultimate. Uh, dream you see the ultimate dream i can never know when it will be on earth goal goal is far but if you set objectives 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 means very very well decided results that i want to reach by a time limit if the objective must be smart capital letters by s we mean specific by m we mean measurable or reliable uh, smart uh, huh? uh, uh, a a attainable or achievable and t means time bound listen for what محدد يبقى objective و characteristics بتاعته قلناه كمان. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. In planning, in planning, صفحة 24, you have to know the elements of administration. What are the elements of administration? It includes planning, organization. Staffing, directing, coordinating, reporting, budgeting. So this is an important part to know 
what of the elements of administration ايه اللي جوه الادمنستريشن تحتوي على ايه كاليمنت again you have uh, uh, in page 26 what's goal and what's objective again i already told you about it yes okay evaluation page 33 in evaluation page 33 you have to know that elements of evaluation in front of you we have relevance adequacy accessibility so when you evaluate a health program or a health procedure or a health department uh, work you have to uh, report on relevance, adequacy, accessibility, acceptability of the work, effectiveness of the work, efficiency and impact. I want you to know what is the difference between effectiveness and efficiency. Il far between effectiveness and efficiency. Bebasata, effectiveness means that we do the work in a good way to reach, to reach the results I want to reach, simply, full stop. This is effectiveness. It means that the procedure you are adopting is a good procedure because you arrive and you reach the results you want to reach. This is effectiveness. Okay. When I say efficiency, it's like effectiveness, yes, but you have to add, to add in efficiency, that you do the good work to arrive to the results huh? with reference to the resources you have. يعني هنا فيها بعد اقتصادي لازم اعمل الحاجة كويسة within the resources available. Once I ask you about effectiveness of efficiency, be careful because if you find that I consider my resources, so this is efficiency. If I don't put it, so in general, I do my work in a good way to reach the results, it is effectiveness. من قبل بداية من بداية صفحة واحد يعني لحد ستة وعشرين. اسأل اسأل. ما فيش أي حاجة مهمة. من واحد لكم؟ أنا ما أعرف بس أنا م... بس ركز في اللي أنا بقوله ركزوا في اللي أنا بقوله قوي وفي النهاية you will have the recording of today okay this is most important and then of course you have to read the topics. Uh, as a whole. تمام يا باسل؟ أنا مش ماشية معاكوا كلمة في كلمة بس يعني إيه؟ uh, concentrate on what will be said during the today's lecture. تمام؟ تمام يا يلا um, the next topic international patient safety goals. What's international patient safety goals? By definition, and according and with reference to the name, patient safety, patient safety goals. These are the goals put by WHO to maintain and to protect patient safety. We are always trying in delivery of health care to uh, protect the patient safety. So what are the goals set by WHO? We have six goals. For you as undergraduate students, you have to know, you have to know, each goal is aiming to do what? In another means, goal one is uh, trying to identify, huh? Correctly, the patient. So, goal one, uh, ABC, ABC patient safety is to identify the patient. 
when he enters to the health facility you are managing you have to identify him بالعربي دلوقتي انتوا عارفين لما حد بيروح اي مستشفى ولا يدخل ان بيشنت ولا حاجه بيلبسوه كده بريسلت غويشه كده عارفينها عليها اسمه عليها عمره عليها جنسه سو بيشنت ايدنتيفيكيشن جول 1 از مينت باي بيشنت ايدنتيفيكيشن او بيشنت كوركت بيشنت ايدنتيفيكيشن جول 2 to improve effective communication with patient goal 3 improve the safety of high alert medications okay goal 4 ركزوا في دي goal 4 to ensure to ensure that when you deal with the patient in the hospital that you are dealing with the correct site if you if you are planning to do a surgery the correct procedure and the correct patient surgery يعني مش ندخل عيان غلط مكان عيان او بدل ما نشتغل يمين نشتغل شمال وهكذا اللي هو correct patient surgery site and procedure goal 5 to reduce the risk of health care associated infections and for goal five we have a separate topic called hospital acquired infections or nosocomial infections we will discuss it later now goal six is meant by reduction of the risk of patient falls طبعا بيحصل العينه تدخل تولد وهي بتولد البيبي بيستقبلوه كده يتزفلط منهم وقع على الارض البيبي البيبي ده مات مصيبه يعني طبعا أو البيبي ده حصل له آه عاهة مستديمة في البرين فممكن يحصل فولز العيان بينقلوه من على سرير على سرير في العمليات أوب يقع منهم بيتكسر بيحصل بيحصل فإذا جول 6 is to reduce risk of patient harm resulting from falls دي أهم حتة هنا هو بقولها تمام أوكي يلا أوكي نروح على ااا وات نروح على ايه؟ نوزوكوميال انفكشن امبورتنت توبيك نوزوكوميال انفكشن از ان امبورتنت توبيك اند وي هاف ا لوت اوف انترستنج انفورميشن انسايد وان تو كونسيدر ذات ا بيشنت ذات از كومبليننج فروم فيفر اند سيمتومز اند ساينز اوف انفكشن One to consider that he acquired the infection inside the hospital. Ha! Huh? This is a question. One. Had the other you all? Amira Morshid Salimah. Amira, can you tell me? Amira. Khawaida. مفيش هوايدة برضه عمر هوايدة موجودة أهلا يا هوايدة النت مش حلوة النهاردة هوايدة إيه الأخبار؟ الحمد لله تمام زي حضرتك كده الحمد لله متابعة معايا من الأول؟ أه أه مركزين في اللي بقوله واضح؟ أيوه أيوه تمام Can you tell me please if you have if you have a manager in a hospital and one of your patients Uh, in patient in uh, say uh, surgery department starts to complain of fever uh, when you will consider that this patient acquired the infection in your hospital امتى لو جالوا امتى الاعراض تقدري تقولي ولا لسه بدري عشان ما ذاكرتيش لا والله لسه برضه ما ذاكرتش مش عارفه والله Yes. Uh, yes. بصي يا حبيبتي أنا طبعاً uh, بسألك ليه؟ Why do I ask you؟ مش عشانك أنت ما تعرفيش. 
بيكوز اي وونت اول اوف يو تو كونسنتريت اون وات اي ساي لا هقولوا ده هو ده اللي هيثبت في دماغكم هو ده مهم حتى لو انتوا جيتوا تذاكروا لوحدكم ممكن ما تركزوش فيه بس ذيس از ذا امبورتنت انفورميشن افتر 48 hours افتر ادميشن شوف انا بقول ايه اهو يبقى امتى 48 hours افتر ادميشن يا اميره ماشي يا اميره شفت المسج بتاعتك ثانك يو في مشكله في المايك ما فيش مشكله اوكي يا حبي آه آه. نرجع تاني فعشان كده لما سالتك يا هويده المعلومه دي هتثبت عندك انت بالذات ولما هتجيلك انت اللي هتجاوبيها صح امتى اللي فاتت اف يو اف يو ار اوبن يور بوك اوكي بيج 57 نوزوكوميال انفكشن ان امبورتنت توبيك يلا عمر بيلو دو يو هير مي Omar? Omar? Okay, I'll wait for Omar to see the mic. I think Omar, you, you are not Egyptian. Uh, and I'm trying to make a mix. I, I speak in English and then translate something into Arabic. So please uh, follow us. Nozokomiel Infection, page 57. Let me read with you some important sentences, please. In the first paragraph, we say that infections are considered hospital acquired if they first appear 48 hours or more after hospital admission. This is important. If you have a patient that you admit today and now he is feverish, you will not say that Your hospital is the source of his infection. لا في الحالة دي هو جاي لنا معدي أو لبادي. هو جاي لنا عيان بعدوى. يبقى ما نظلمش نفسنا. But if after 48 hours or more, he acquires the infection عندي. ونعتبرها hospital acquired infection. نكمل. Or within 30 days after operation. If he is, if he underwent a surgery in my hospital and then he has been discharged uh, we continue follow up because this patient if within 30 days of the operation even if he if he left the hospital and went home if he uh, uh, sorry if he develops symptoms and signs of infection it means that he acquired the infection at the hospital yep, 30 days after operation The next paragraph is important. So we say that up to 48 hours after hospital admission, the right three days after discharge. Okay, up to 30 days after operation. Yes. Still in the same topic. It's important. Who is at risk for a nosocomial infection? Anyone is at risk? Yes, anyone in a hospital is at risk for hospital acquired infection, and we can call it nosocomial infection. Anyone in the hospital is at risk. Patients are at risk. Of course, the healthcare staff are at risk also, but now we are talking about patients and hospital acquired infection. Who is at risk? Of course, uh, patients who are in the same room with others with infection. Extremity of ages. So age, especially people who are more than 70 years old, uh, long use of antibiotics. If I ask you uh, in, in one of MCQs and we say that the uh, uh, long term use of antibiotics can lead to hospital acquired infections. Yes. Because the abuse of antibiotics lead to emergence of resistant strains of bacteria and, of course, can lead to hospital acquired infections. Prolonged ICU stay, uh, uh, staying in a coma, of course. Yes, so this is important. Who is at risk for nosocomial infection? And then in page 59, how to reduce, how to reduce. Yeah, yeah we want, I, I want to tell you something that 
Yovinavi catheterization is common as a cause that can lead to hospital acquired infection. Lemakibin astava. The ND way of the whole tab on the infections with bacteria of Shakla Ajib did. Bad the Keda. Why? Why? Now, in page 60, what of the major sites? Again, what of the major infection? In, in, in order, the most common nosocomial infections are of the urinary tract, surgical wounds, burns, and respiratory tract. So, if you have a question with what is, what is the most common site for nosocomial infection, and you have all of these, you will choose the urinary tract uh, infections. But if you have this and one of the answer, all of the above, choose please all of the above. So if you have all of the above, so all of these are common sites. But if I ask you uh, uh, about the most common anatomical site, it will be the urinary tract anatomical site. Bad, pardon? Hospital waste, yes, important. Hospital waste. Uh, simply, hospital waste, and here we are talking about the hospital waste management. Simply, the hospital, as any of our homes, has waste at the end of the day. But the waste in a hospital is totally different than domestic waste. So waste in our homes, the basket that the end of the day, the or we that is domestic waste. In our homes, the daily wastes are called domestic waste. In a hospital, they have domestic waste, yes, as any homes, okay? Uh, remnants of food, remnants of toilet papers, okay? But, but they have a big, a big portion of different categories. We have hazardous waste, we have infectious waste, we have radioactive material in hospitals who are treating cancers and others. But I need different kinds of waste. Uh, so you have to study the different types of uh, categories of waste. They are eight main categories. Very clear in your book, the eight categories of waste. Then, then, uh, impact on health, of course, they, they, are, they, they have a negative impact on health of employees that are dealing with waste, with healthcare staff, with patients, with visitors, and the environment. The most important thing in hospital waste will be the management of waste. To manage the waste, we have as a first step to make sorting according to the category. That's why we have three, I think three, yes. Mm. Yes, we have three colors of bags according to the category of waste and plus, plus the most important huh, safety container uh, that's called the safety box. Safety box uh, is meant by the shops and needles uh, and all those who can lead to puncture of injuries. The safety box. We put it in the air, we put it in the air, we put it in the air, So we have the safety box and we have three different uh, back colors. Uh, the black for the domestic waste, العدية, the yellow for radioactive, and the red for infectious waste. But the sorting and then handling of waste, storage of waste, and then the final disposal of waste. How to finally dispose the waste? We have 
فور ايتمز ان سينيفيشن يعني الحرق بنحرق بقيه الفضلات المستشفيات ستابيلايزيشن تعقيم ترانسفير تو انذر سايت اند لاند فيلينج لاند فيلينج طبعا بتبقى مينلي للفيديو اكتيف ماتيريال اوكي تمام حلو هوسبيتال انديكيتورز Hospital indicators يعني إيه؟ Hospital indicators من مؤشرات المستشفيات. مؤشرات يعني this is a calculation that we are making to uh, give an idea about something which happens. Indicator مؤشر بنحسب حاجة ونطلع بيها بفكرة بمعلومة بفيدباك عن اللي بيحصل. عشان كده بنقول إنه an indicator gives an idea about what happened. But خلوا بالكم من but دي. It can never be used as an ABA مكتوب عندكم as an exclusive measure to the performance. You want to know the performance in your hospital. أنت عايز تعرف الشغل ماشي إزاي في different departments, satisfaction of the patient, outcome بتاع العلاج والمست وال والعمليات وغيره outcome يعني clinical outcome الناس بتخف ولا بيحصل لها مضاعفات ولا إيه. How to deal with all of these data? Through indicators, an indicator uh, is used, of course, to to have an idea about the performance, but it's not an exclusive measure of the performance. بعد كده يا عبد الرحمن, we have many indicators, and we can classify them into indicators that can measure the patient satisfaction or demi aho. حاجات دي uh, indicators that can measure the clinical outcome and indicators that can measure the performance of the hospital. Performance uh, patient satisfaction uh, is have indicators like what? I'll give you some examples. Yes, repeated visits in outpatient clinic. ناس بتروح وبترجع علينا تاني والكلام ده اوكي فاين يبقى هو المكان كويس. إلا إذا كان راجع يتخانق دي قصة تانية. Uh, elective surgery cancellations دي مش حاجة حلوة. Uh, leave against medical advice اللي بيكتب خروج على مسؤوليته مش عايز يقعد عندنا ولا لحظة. يبقى دي patient satisfaction indicators. طب clinical outcome indicators are very easy. All what's related to medical فعلا results بمعنى hospital acquired infections و Uh, معدل حدوثها قد ايه؟ This is a clinical outcome performance. Urinary tract infections, bloodstream infections, respiratory tract infections, وهكذا. All of these, ونقلب الصفحة, all of these are clinical performance indicators. طيب, the business performance indicators تعني ايه؟ دي بقى معروفة دي أي مدير هيهمه قوي Business performance indicators. عايز نسب إشغال عالية طول الوقت. He wants that all beds are occupied all the time. So business performance indicators. من الكلمة اللي أنا قلتها أكيد فيها bed occupancy ratio, فيها bed capacity أصلاً تعت المستشفى. Bed capacity هي هي inpatient bed count. يبقى inpatient bed count اللي هو اسمه bed capacity. Average length of stay, bed occupancy rate, death rate. تمام؟ Okay. Uh, to make it easy for you, uh, I'll select four important ind indicators that you have to study in details. Like what? Inpatient bed count. Average length of stay. Bed occupancy rate and death rate. Simply. Again, inpatient bed count. Average length of stay, bed occupancy rate, uh, and death rate. تمام؟ حلو. سهلة أوي. نروح على uh, the last topic اللي أنتوا كلكم زوغتوا منه اللي هو the most interesting one في المنهج. Mass casualty and pre-hospital emergency care. What's mass casualty? Casualty يعني مش معناها نمشي casual ونلبس كده حاجات casual الصبح. كاجواليتي يعني طوارئ كاجواليتي ما فيهاش اي بعد ال كاجواليتي طوارئ ماس 
يعني كمية كبيرة من المصابين عدد كبير من المصابين mass casualty means involvement of a large number of injured people or patients or individuals due to a disaster حصل مصيبة this disaster could be man-made يعني انفجار بفعل فاعل يعني حد عمل فساد في مبنى وبعدين انهار على اللي فيه this is man-made or natural disaster دي بقى البراكين والزلازل والحاجات دي كلها النتيجة the result of casualties is large number of injured individuals أكمل كلامي the problem فين أنت بتقول إيه المشكلة the problem is that they are at the same time تاني any health care facility is ready to serve patients and individuals but within a frequency معينة I mean if you receive per day 100 patients of 200 okay we know how to manage but if you are facing in a geographic area a big casualty mass casualty of course the needs الاحتياج دلوقتي the needs now for emergency and health care will be beyond the facilities available هتبقى أكتر بكتير من الفاسيلتيز اللي عندي كمستشفى واللي عند المستشفى اللي جنبي وهكذا. This is mass casualty. That's why it needs huh, good preparation, good management, and good application uh, of and delivery of uh, services لما نعوز. تمام؟ This is mass casualty simply. هنقول ايه اللي مهم في الماس casualty بقى؟ <تصفيق> تفتكروا أنا هسألكوا على طول تفتكروا uh, what you say in mass casualty the first objective بتاعنا إحنا as doctors who will move and to be displaced to the to, to the area where the mass casualty happens دي اللي بنسميها pre-hospital emergency care إحنا we are moving with all facilities to the area where the mass casualty happens why? To rescue lives. So the, ob so the objective is to rescue lives. أهم حاجة إنقاذ أكبر عدد من الناس لحياتهم. Uh, to do that, we must be very well equipped and very well prepared first to make something very important. Huh? To make triage. Triage. Triage means مفصل. ونقسم الحالات on the earth في مكان casualty according to what when you go to the mass casualty area and you have a lot of injured people in front of you you will serve the whom first the first one you face or you have to uh, to make a triage first why to classify people according to what according to severity of injury وليس according to أي حاجة تانية لأنه my aim is to rescue people أهم حاجة قدر الإمكان so we have to make a good triage in triage we have labels green color yellow color and uh, uh, sorry yes green, yellow, red and black يفكركوا بالويست بس إحنا مش في ويست إحنا في بني أدمين The, ba sorry, the black color, the black color means dead people or moribund. Moribund يعني بيحتضر ميت يعني. So black colors are for moribund people. The red color means emergency. يجي ورايا على طول أنا بعمل تخياج ومعايا في التيم ناس بتتعامل وجاية تسعف على طول وتلحق الناس دي. The red color for emergency. The yellow color for medium or intermediate. Intermediate priority يعني اه ممكن اه برضو برضو حالته خطر بس ايه مش زي اللي بتوع الريد كالر The green color mean ambulatory لا ده يستنى معايا شوية ده ما يعني ها ده يا دوب محتاج ما عرفش ايه وشوية مية او بتاع وهيبقى كويس ممكن يقوم يسعف معايا الباقيين ياخد ايه green color This is in triage After triage we are dealing with people وننقل على المستشفى How can we Move people to hospital. جملة مهمة. 
that transport of injured people from the area of disaster to the hospital must be staggered. What's meant by staggered? Staggered means متعاقب. ما نقلش كل الناس اللي في الموقع دول في, في إسعافين ثلاثة كده at once to the hospital. No, it must be staggered. ليه? Uh, for not making a bigger load on the hospital emergency. يبقى أنا in the field, I have to rescue and do all my best. When the people struggled, and the staff to go to add two, three, and then to go to me, I can have to add someone else. Okay, fine. I rescue his life. And then he'll do it. يبقى النقل يكون متعاقب وإحنا هدفنا زي ما قلنا to rescue people. To rescue lives. تمام؟ آخر حاجة أن بنعمل tagging. The tagging system نفس الموضوع uh, using tags. Name tag. عارفين ال name tag ما دي مع الخياج. بتبقى جاهزة مسبقا. Uh, red, uh, green, yellow and black to put on it the name ID بأي طريقة patient identification برضو. If it met علشان الناس تقف بيكون في برضو من الستاف ناس تبلغ اهالي الناس دي تطمنها وتطمن الاسر على الناس اللي لها وفي مين وفي مفقود وفي توفى وفي راح المستشفى وهكذا تمام؟ This is rapidly زي تور كده عملنا فسحه عملنا تور في المنهج بتاعنا اوكي؟ طيب if you have any feedback اوكي before I proceed ها يا زينب زينب تقول زينب هلو عثمان is back I think there is technical problems in the network because عثمان was leaving and then back okay عثمان can you hear me now unmute your mic if you can <تصفيق> yes, عثمان. Okay. طيب by any means you will have the recording available uh, with all the topics revision. حد يا أولاد طب مين؟ آية؟ آية عبد الناصر. يا آية. آية دكتور. إيه الأخبار؟ لا تمام تمام انا متابعه من اول محاضره حلو قوي حسيت طب انا هسالكم انا مش ولا لسه سامع ريكوردينج ولا اي حاجه ولكن كده في الحاجات فهمتوا شويه امم يا هواي ده قول هو يا دكتور هو دكتور هو لو متاح يعني لو متاح يعني حضرتك تنزل لنا اسئله اكتر نتدرب وكده غير الاسئله بتاعت انا حاضر وانا نزلت لكم اسئله لا لا ما نزلتش يعني بس تقريبا المراجعه بتاعت المره اللي فاتت كان شويه فيها اسئله أه لا لقيتوها يعني في لقيتوها في الريكوردينجز ولا ايه لا مش مش لا مش موجودة يا دكتورة في الأسئلة مش موجودة قصدي في الفايلز يعني أمال أنت جبتوها منين؟ <تصفيق> لا لا يا دكتور أنا تقريبا اتلخبطت من المادة التانية بس يعني المهم يعني ممكن حضرتك تنزل لنا أسئلة ولا إيه؟ ليت مي حالا إحنا هنراجع مع بعض فايل كده في أسئلة حاضر حالا زين عايز تقول حاجة زين لا دكتور شكرا هو تقريبا النت كان قطع عندي ف <تصفيق> طيب مش عارف ايه زين يا زين يا زين اسمعني هو انت الصوره اللي انت حاططها دي ايه؟ اه دكتور لا دكتور دي دي صوره من فيلم لعادل امام <تصفيق> انا عارف <عارف>. ايه دي؟ انت <تصفيق> خضتني يا ابني انا قلت احنا معانا طلبه مين ده؟ ماشي يس اوكي طيب دي صورة. ممكن حاجة بس في التوبكس اللي علينا تاني معلش. 
باسل ها انا اسف عايز ايه اقول التوبكس بس اللي علينا تاني معلش اقولها تاني كلها لا يعني اللي علينا بس اللي هي يعني انا ايوه ما انا عارفه يعني اقولها تاني اسمها صح؟ اه تمام معلش يا دكتور حاضر يلا هيلث مانجمنت بيج 7 طبعا لما اقول بيج 7 يعني مش بيج 7 بس لغايه ما يخلص الموضوع مش كده؟ اوكي Hospital Administration and Hospital Management, page 17. Management, page 24. International Patient Safety Goals, page 36. Nosocomial Infection, page 57. Hospital Waste Management, page 65. Hospital Indicators, page 69. Quality Improvement in Health Care, 74. Mass Casualty Management, page 79. Three Hospital Emergency Care, page 82. كل حاجة اللي ما تخلص. ماشي؟ سلام دكتور. شكرا. ماشي يا باس. اوعى تقرأ الصفحات بس الأولانية اللي أنا بقولها دي. حاضر دكتور. وبعدين تطلعوا لي التسجيل وتقولوا يا دكتور الناس اللي قالت لنا. Let me share with you the screen with some questions to make it more clear. The screen we have is here. I'm going to put on the questions. Yeah, why is that? I'm. I did with you the questions. Yes or no? Hmm. مش باين عندي حاجة يا دكتور لا دي طلعت طلعتش مش طالعة هي باينة عندي يا دكتور ما هو واضحة عندي يا دكتور الله يا هوايدة <تصفيق> بيقول لك طالعة عندهم استني تمام دلوقتي دلوقتي باين الشاشة عندي يا دكتور تقريبا في مشكلة في النت أو حاجة طيب طلع لك دلوقتي خلاص؟ اه تمام هي دي اللي بتقول لا احنا احنا يعني اللي مش في تو تو دلوقتي هيحسدكم لان احنا عملنا مراجعة حلوة قوي في ريسيرش ويعني عندكم اسئلة حلوة كتير ما تقلقوش مش شكرا لحضرتك يا دكتور ماشي تعالي اللي في تو وان دلوقتي هيحسدكم تحسدوهمش بقى يلا نعمل برضو أسئلة في الهوسبيتال مانجمنت أهو وده هيخليكو uh, these questions are training questions okay similar to what you will find on the day of the exam so please please make sure that you revise it well with me and you will find it in the recording My My policy is one of you, even if the the answer is here, about the topic, so it make it at a global revision. Who will start with the first question? Who is it? Yalla, Antiba. Yalla, who is it? Yeah. First question, we. Okay. Uh, management is considered with the determined of objective and uh, policy. Mm. The answer is that without studying, you, you, you will be lost. But Anna Fubdait Kalemi, when I started, I told you that administration is concerned with determination of object. عشان قلت كده administration the higher level من الإدارة هم اللي بيقرروا ال objectives وال policies تمام ولكن ال management بنطبق بس يبقى who is concerned with uh, what is concerned with determination of objectives and policies administration وليس management 
So if you find that policies can fail, if you find that management is concerned with determination of object of objectives, and this is a long statement. Zero concerned with determination of objectives is administration. تمام تمام. وأنا جبت لكم التانية غلط باب ده هو ليه عشان نخلف الكلمتين في الصح. Who will read the second one? يلا. يلا يا باسل. يلا يا باسل. Administration is a process of implement the plans and the policies for achievement of objectives. ها. فولس ليه؟ لأن أنا قلت إنه what is concerned with the process of implementing implementing يعني تطبق implementation of implementing means تطبيق means uh, application so what is meant uh, what is concerned with process of implementing plans and policies this is management or mal administration is Administration, administration is concerned with determination of objectives. If I put this word in the place of the other word, let them remember that they are going to be right. Okay, ma'am, get that? Okay. Yeah. Number three, what did you say? Abdul Rahman. Uh, objective is a planned endpoint of all activities. True. Yes, true. Bosu, planned endpoint of all activities. Haga planned, measurable endpoint of what I make. This is objective. Mish goal. A goal there, an ultimate, ultimate dream. This is the ultimate. Ultimate معناها يعني اللي بيسموه إيه ultimate. I cannot measure it by end of activities. ولا بنهاية اليوم ولا بنهاية الشهر. The goal. Okay. So objective is a plan and the point of all activities. Yes. This is a true statement. مين يقول بعده؟ أنا ممكن يا دكتور. يال. بس قول لي اسمك عشان انا دلوقتي شايفه بس الاسئله مش شايفاك. انا يا باسل برضه. يلا يا باسل كويس يا باسل يلا. السؤال نمر اربعه نمر اربعه ا جول ماست بي ريلايبل ميجرابل اند تايم سبيسيفيك فولس عشان ده الاوبجيكتيف مش الجول. برافو ذا جول جاي وراه ماشي يبقى فور تريننج. Goal must be reliable, measurable, and time with specific command. No, that this is the lower smart characteristics of objective. Okay, if a D falls, number five, who will make it? Osman, are you here? Okay, go ahead. Number five, question five. Goal is goal is defined as the ultimate desire state towards the object. Towards objectives are directed. True. Yes, true. At once you find the word ultimate desired, <laughs> put it true for goal. Ultimate. This is my ultimate desire state. And I do all my procedures to achieve my objectives to reach the ultimate goal in the future. You see? So all objectives are directed, of course, toward the ultimate desired state in the future, which is the goal. Yep, uh, this is a true statement. Yes. Omar, are you here? Omar Bello. Yes, doctor. Yes, I'm happy that you are here. Go ahead. Number six. Baseline manager is the person who is responsible for for the overall work and operation. No, no. Uh, yes, for this for this question, you will refer to page in 
just one moment. Uh, because uh, they, they are, yes, uh, in management, in management, okay, page 24, in topic management, page 24, you have the levels of management. And number one, it's written top managers. Top managers are responsible for the overall work and operations. So this is the first, sorry, this is the top manager. And then we have the middle managers. And then we have the first line manager who is responsible for coordinating and managing certain work. For example, head of a geography department. So the three, three managers are written clearly in page 24. Yes. Omar, uh, please proceed and continue with number seven. Because okay, this doctor. is in the same part. Yes, go ahead. Okay. Hospital administrator coordinated all uh, department within a health care facility. Yes. The hospital administrator coordinate all departments within a health care facility. For not, for not to be sad about such questions, be sure that if you find one of these questions, it will be the same. Don't be there. The first line manager is the person who is responsible for the overall work and operation false. If you have the hospital administrator coordinate all departments within a healthcare facility, true. Tamam keda? Yes. Uh, now, number eight, I need Masaran Fimintani. Huh? Who else? Me, you all number eight. I'm going to cry, doctor. Yalla, hurt. Elements of administration include. Of course, you didn't study yet, but when you study, it will be so easily. And then I will tell you, please read carefully elements of administration. In elements of administration, you will find that we have planning, we have organizing, we have directing, we have coordinating. If I put this three, so it means that the answer is all of the above. OK? Leaning is considered the most important element of administration process. True. Yes. Yes, true. Simple, simple statement. Planning, of course. The administration uh, are planning for everything and are planning for objectives and are planning for the procedures. Then the management comes to implement. Netabba. If a planning is considered the most important element of administration, yes. Hmm. Uh, who else? Mini you Yellow? Yes. Yes. Evaluation. Evaluation, a simple statement also. Evaluation is a systemic collection of information about activities and outcomes of a program? Yes, of course. To evaluate, organizing, to collect information about the activities and the outcomes of the program and start to analyze what happens. This is evaluation. I got to say, I'm going to talk about it. Who are you? Who are you? Regarding mm -hmm. hospital waste, uh, body parts and or organs are the most important infection, uh, infectious waste. False. Why false? Of body parts and organs are infectious. Okay, or maybe infectious. They are not the most important infection. The most important infectious waste. Such a statement, if you encounter at your exam, is it, uh, it's a false statement. The hospital 
سوري ذا بودي بارتس اند اورجنز اللي هي موجوده في الويست في المستشفى ار انفكشوس يس بس ذي ار نوت ذا موست امبورتنت انفكشوس يلا اللي بعدها من يقولها آه. يلا Domestic type waste categorized as general waste. So. Yes, Rob. احنا قلنا general waste هو اللي زي بتاع البيت بتاعنا وده اسمه domestic waste. يبقى domestic type of waste is categorized as general waste. True statement. كم كم بعد كريم محمد يا كريم كريم اوكي ايا ار يو هير ايا دكتور يلا يا ايا قولنا رقم 29 Steps of hospital waste management uh, includes the following uh, sorting, mm -hmm. handling, and storage uh, All of the above All of the above, very simple كملي كملي يا ايه Incentration is an important step لا. in storage is an important step Uh, in storage of hospital waste, false. Lay false also. علشان الحرق ده من الهندلينج. برافو يعني هي كويسة هي مش ستورج عشان كده قلت فوق. Yes. Incineration yes is an important step, but not in the storage. It is in the final disposal. تخلص النهائي مش الهندلينج. Okay. So incineration. is an important step in final disposal of hospital waste. That's صح. In storage, دي غلط. It's not for storage. It's for final disposal. Okay? تمام. طيب يلا مين هيقول اللي بعدها؟ أنا مين؟ مين اللي بيقول؟ زين؟ يلا يا باسل. قول. Effectiveness, the second dimension of quality of healthcare includes the following except outcomes. لا 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 استن. Dimensions of quality, please. إيه ما قلت dimensions. أنت قلت خلاص. آه لأن أنا اتلخبطت في الأول بعد كده رجعت لها. طب يلا dimensions. Dimensions of quality in healthcare includes the following except outcome. The outcome, لي. لأنه الـ dimensions of quality uh, yes فيها effectiveness فيها efficiency فيها continuity of care this is dimensions كل دي dimensions in delivering the health care with good quality but the outcome is not a dimension ده النتيجة بقى مالناش دعوة بيه مش dimensions اللي أنا بشتغل بيها أوكي تمام so except the outcome كمل أنت برضه يا باسل كده I got the line I could be looking at you when I was young. Effectiveness, effectiveness of health care means provide the greatest benefit within the resource available. غلط دي تبع efficiency. برافو عليك. بدي ال efficiency. Effectiveness of health care means providing the greatest benefit. Hmm. Uh. Or providing the good. The good. Procedure in a good way, not once on within resources available by drug. Efficiency, efficiency of health care means doing the right thing in the right way. No, no, uh, false. Taba, 
efficiency. Tafana efficiency means provision of the greatest benefit within the resources available. But in Hena Gumra Sahatebe, quality. Quality of health care means doing the right thing in the right way. This is quality simply. You are doing the right thing in a good way. This is quality. Okay. Uh, continuity of health care services can be achieved by keeping accurate medical records, of course, yes. That's the idea, yeah, like that. You can have always accurate medical records to be able to continue to continue up your patients with a system real health care. This is a true statement. But because yes, the framework you get here, framework of quality, framework of quality. اللي فوق احنا um, upward we, uh, we answered a question about dimensions of quality. Dimensions of quality uh, includes effectiveness, efficiency, uh, but outcome no. Now, framework of quality. The framework of quality includes the structure of your hospital, the processes you are doing in your hospital, the outcome in Natayik Taban Betai Choglak, call it a framework, but appropriateness no. You have Adi, the framework of quality. Mass casualty, let's say Len. In mass casualty, the aim of medical services is to provide care to the largest number of patients. Taban, Koloko, Kalas, Drocha, Alfin. The answer is true. Successful response to mass casualty. Lazim ibn Anam Staidab A. Telco, trained personnel, adequate facilities, and extra supplies. La Anu Daiman in needs beyond the available facilities. But all of the above. Triage is rapidly classifying the injured persons on the basis of a helming awil on the basis of severity of their injuries. In triage, the principle of first come, first treated Netabao La Ataban and I'll tell first come, first treated. Anna Libabhas wa amil triage lil musabin. Red color indicate ambulatory patients galat false. You know the meaning of ambulatory? Ambulatory means patient ممكن ينتظر. إصابته مش خطيرة. يبقى red color مش لي. Red color means dead patient غلط برضو. أمال red color means a emergency patient. أمال dead patient needs which color? Ha? Black color. أمال ambulatory patients needs which color? The green color. Okay? These questions are available with answers in your recording. I am good. We recording all of you are good. The time. I have got you. Come. We had an extended time, and if you have any feedback or reflection now, please go ahead. If you have any questions, I will answer. We are going to be recording. Do all recordings. The recordings are good. وانتوا تذاكروا زي ما قلنا وخلتوني اعيد عليكم تاني ارقام الصفحات والتوبكس يعني ات ويل بي ايزي ما تقلقوش ها حد عنده اي سؤال؟ يا ولاد باسل عنده سؤال وباسل مصطفى عنده سؤال وباسل علاء عنده سؤال يلا دلوقتي في اللي هم في 57 النزول كوميال انفكشن ايوه في مكتوب رابع بوينت في اللي هي الاتش اي اي انفكشن ماستر كير رابع بوينت ان هيلث كير فاسيلتي وان سمون واز اميتد فور ريزنز اذر ذان ذا انفكشن مش ده طبيعي يعني ولا هو ده يعني دي لازم تبقى موجوده انا مش فاهم لا برافو عليك ده الطبيعي ما هو دي معلش اف اف اتس بوت از از ان اندبندنت بوينت سوري ذيس از ان اكسبلانيشن تو تيل يو ذات 
for when to consider a hospital acquired infection. Of course, if the patient was not admitted for infection. تمام؟ يعني أنت ما تجيش في مستشفى حميات وأنت أصلاً حاجز حالات كلها infections, infections وتقول لي عنده دلوقتي infection. ماشي؟ ما هو جاي يتعالج من infection أصلاً. فذيس إز أن أوبمال سنتنس يو أر لايت. يبقى إحنا نهتم بأول ثلاث معلومات. Uh, up to 48 hours after hospital admission, up to three days after discharge, up to 30 days after operation. This is for when to consider hospital acquired infection in page 57. Yes, Bess, you are right. Thank you, Doctor. Yala, Bess and Mustafa, you had uh, something to say? يلا انا معاك يا بس قول تحب ايه <تصفيق> يا بس لا يا دكتور شكرا دكتور بس الحقيقة شكرا يعني بس ثانك يو ميرسي يا حبايبي ثانك يو اتمنى الامور تبقى واضحه اي هوب ايفريثينج از كلير يو هاف اول ذا دوكيومنتس اند ريسورسز سبيشالي ذات اوف توداي اوكي I have to stop the recording for you to be able to use it. Afu, 